What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. St. Press in the body detail here, Michael. Thursday afternoon. Here we are, back in the gym. Today is shoulder and back day. Today's exercise is going to be behind the net Smith press, barbell shrug, and V bar uh, sitting V bar cable rows to the back. So hope you enjoy. Uh, we got 57. We got a 57 pound bar here. And then we have 25s on the end, so we got 107 pounds. I've already done a couple of sets of warm up with just the bar. Always make sure you warm up your shoulders. Make sure you're comfortable doing these movements. Some of these things are not made for everyone. Stick around, guys. We're going to only be going heavier. One twenty seven. All right, we got two hundred two pounds, guys. Got two and a half, ten, thirty five, twenty five. The bar and this carriage together is 57. You do the math. Let's get a one rep max. Four seventy-five. 
exercise of the day we're hitting the back we're doing some uh, low cable rows I've got 140 pounds on the machine and uh, I don't know how heavy I'll go up with this probably around 200 or so just depends uh, ready to get her done and uh, go eat some supper so let's get some rows done guys and gals one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, I'm going to do five more sets. I'll probably just film one more set whenever I get to my highest weight, and we'll call it done, guys. So stick around for the closing clips, and uh, keep doing your thing. <laughs> Two forty, two forty. just like that we're done with another workout that's another day in the books literally uh, pretty happy with what I did with my behind the neck presses I uh, went up to 202 pounds uh, anybody uh, that questions the weight just know that the bar in that carriage and everything that that bar is hooked up to when it's put on a scale weighs 57 pounds there's no counterbalance I don't have any of that fancy get up that some Smith machines have that make the bar light as a feather because it's counterbalanced with weights and cables and stuff. That's just a straight bar with uh, those carriage housing things uh, attached. So that's all 57 pounds. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with that. I probably could have got a couple reps with that, but I didn't want to press, no pun intended, my luck uh, with my shoulders and everything. Uh, then the barbell shrugs. Now I'm going to get some people, my God, man, you shouldn't have went up that heavy. You didn't get a full range of motion. Well, technically, a full range of motion for a shrug is only about an inch and a half, if that. So, you know, uh, shrugs to me are the one exercise you can do and have some fun with. There's not a whole lot of repercussions. Is that the correct word? Not a whole lot of danger uh, to have some fun with shrugs. As long as you know your body, know your back. You know, I have a chronic bad back, but I know how to move. I know how to stand. I know how to get myself into position. And I know what I'm capable of. At this point, I've had my back problem for 25 years now. So I know what I can do. It's not this that hurts my back uh, that will throw it out completely. It's flipping a light switch. So uh, have fun with shrugs, guys. Just take it easy. Know your body. Know what you're doing. And uh, then on the uh, double D uh, low cable rows, I went up to 240. I felt pretty good. I got 10 reps. I can't. I can't fault that, that's pretty good. And they were all pretty good reps too. And uh, I did that on my third set. And then for the next three final sets, I just went back down to 190 and did uh, 10 reps on those. So I got a really good workout and I was making sure I was really stretching out those lats and everything and opening up and then coming back and squeezing real good. That's what you wanna make sure you do when you do the back. Get that stretch in there for them lats and make sure you get a good squeeze off in there. Squeeze! 
Nacho Libre. So anyway, overall a good workout. I'm pleased with everything how it went. I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. I hope I give you a little bit of inspiration to not just work out, to, but to push yourself a little bit. Uh, it's okay to push yourself beyond the limits because that's how we progress. That's how we evolve. That's how we get better is pushing yourself past your comfort zone. Uh, we can all work out with light weights. That's nothing. Uh, it's once you push yourself to the limits. Uh, that's where you start digging in and finding your true colors. So uh, anyway, guys, if you appreciate the video, you found something decent, useful, and helpful, uh, maybe like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. That's me, Michael, your sweaty and uh, hungry host. Uh, I'm eating shrimp, onion mix with some rice and a little bit of mess on there. I don't know what I'm going to do. Some salsa, maybe. A little soy sauce. I don't know what I'm doing. A little something, something, something. going to be good stuff. So anyway, Mike, let's get out of here, okay? All right. Leave me alone. Let's do this. Okay. Get up. Get out. Get red. Do it to it. Don't you ever hit me again, boy. Ever. Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!